Hello everyone, welcome back to College Review Series by Akash. Today we are going to review National Institute of Technology, Sikkim or NIT SKM. So we are going to talk everything about this NIT, about its campus, courses, fee structure, placements, cutoff and trust me, a lot more. NIT Sikkim is a public engineering and research institute which was established in August 2010. The NIT has been given a rank band of 151 to 200 by NIRF 2023. Let's talk about its campus. Presently, the NIT is operating from its temporary campus which is only 20 acres from Ravangla, a subdivision of South Sikkim and it is likely to continue its activities from the temporary campus itself until the permanent campus comes into operations, which is at Khadong, Sikkim. The NIT provides all the basic facilities such as central library, auditorium, hostels for boys and girls, bank, a medical unit, sports facilities. The institute has playgrounds with facilities for playing cricket, football, volleyball, etc. and the other facilities such as laboratories. Talking about the students' activities conducted here, the NIT conducts a number of academic and non-academic activities through various societies and clubs designated to extracurricular activities. That includes Innovation Club, the Community Development Society, IAS, Mechanical Engineer Society, Yantrika, the Illusion Dance Club and the Photography Club. NIT Sikkim students also hold an annual technology festival called Abhiyantran and a three-day socio-cultural fest called Udgam. Coming on to the courses now, the NIT conducts undergraduate and postgraduate courses for its engineering students. There are mainly five BTEC programs conducted here, Civil Engineering, Computer Science and Engineering, Electrical and Electronics Engineering, Electronics and Communication Engineering, and Mechanical Engineering. And to get admission in one of these courses, the students need to first of all qualify Joint Entrance Exam J Main and pass Class 12 Board Examination with Science Stream. 75% is the required percentage for General Category students and 65 is the required percentage for STSC or PWD category. Further, the students register themselves for JOSA counselling based on the marks secured in their J Main. The selected students thereafter verify all their documents and pay the required fees. The foreign students get selected through DASA and ICCR schemes. If you talk about the fee structure, then the fee comprises of tuition fee, institutional charges, admission fee, hostel and mess charges. So approximately, BTEC from NIT Sikkim will cost you between 6.5 to 7 lakh. Here is the consolidated fee structure for different categories. You can pause the video or take a screenshot. Moreover, as per the government norms, all the NITs offer some fee waivers to its meritorious and economically weaker section students, like 100% tuition fee waiver to STSC or PWD category students, for remission of the tuition fee to all the general and OBC category of the students whose family income is less than 1 lakh per annum, two-thirds of remission of the tuition fee to all the general and OBC category students whose family income is between 1 lakh to 5 lakh per annum. In addition, a wide range of scholarship schemes are offered to the students who show excellence academic performances and economically weaker section students. So to get all the details related to the scholarships like name of the scholarship, source of fund, amount or value of the scholarship and eligibility criteria, do visit the link given in the description. Talking about the placements now. NIT Sikkim, which is a newly established NIT, has been experiencing a steady growth since 2010 starting with a placement percentage of 24.16% since 2010 to 2014. The NIT's latest placement rate is 83.7% from 2019 to 2023. The internship statistics show a 100% placement percentage in all the core branches. As per the NIRF 2024 report, 113 undergraduate students were placed during NIT Sikkim placements with a median salary of 8.5 lakh per N. The number of top companies visiting the campus for placement is increasing year by year. Here is a list of some regular recruiters at NIT Sikkim. Now let's move on to cutoff 2023 at NIT Sikkim. See, there are 160 seats available for the BTEC students and 50% seats are reserved for the home state candidates and remaining 50% seats are reserved for the other state candidates. Here is the branch-wise cutoff for both home state and other state candidates after the sixth round of JOSA counselling. After this, there is one more round conducted by CSAP. Now let's start with the civil engineering branch. To be able to make it to the civil engineering, all you have to do is to secure a rank around 10 lakh if you are a home state candidate. 
and if you are an other state candidates then around 55000 is the required rank talking about the computer science and engineering branch see the rank closed at 162246 for home state candidates therefore with around a rank of 160000 also home state candidates can get this branch on the other hand for other state candidates the same closed at 24093 Now let's talk about electrical engineering. The rank after the sixth round closed at six lakh thirty nine thousand two hundred and seventy two for home state candidates. And if you are an other state candidate, then you can get admission by acquiring an approximate rank as forty thousand. For electronics and communication engineering branch, the closing rank stood at two lakh twenty thousand three hundred and fifty two for home state candidates. And for other state candidates, the rank closed at thirty five thousand five hundred and sixty eight. For mechanical engineering branch the closing rank for home state was 8,17,562 and for other state candidates the rank closed at 49,141 For more information on NIT Sikkim cutoff 2023-24 that is category wise rank cutoff like for EWS ST SC or for girls candidates do visit the link given in the description All right Pleasing weather, mountains all around and scenic beauty throughout makes it a perfect location for a 4 year stay. Study wise and facilities wise, NIT Sikkim can be considered as a decent NIT providing all the basic facilities and a good campus life. However, NIT Sikkim cannot be compared to tier 1 or tier 2 NITs as the placement rate is comparatively low. At the very same time if you manage to get a CSC branch here at NIT Sikkim it still assures a better future scope and prospects rest the call is all yours as this was all from me today now you let me know which other college do you want me to review next don't forget to press the like and subscribe button so you do not miss out on any updates for more such informative content stay connected